your jobs. So um, we'll try to make this brief. But thank you so much for being here. Happy President's Day. We have so much to be grateful for with this country. Um, we also have so much to be grateful for working for this wonderful health system. For those of you I do not know, my name is Jill Thompson and I am celebrating our rescheduled employee campaign, Rebuilding Blessings. Hundreds of employee volunteers worked really hard to pull off this successful campaign. From the team captains, the departmental raffle baskets, the cornhole tournament paid participants, the logistical volunteers, the incredible foundation staff, to the 932 donors that make up this total, thank you. Our campaign total historically consists of two efforts, our summer PTO effort and then our fall efforts. Well, a little rain in mid-September <laughs> made things a bit more challenging this year. This has been a, a really interesting campaign, honestly a first for the um, foundation but a testimony to the quality human beings that work for this health system. This year, our campaign actually consisted of four efforts. Our summer PTO, our hurricane assistance effort, a fall post-hurricane effort that quite honestly the foundation hadn't even considered. This was employee driven. Quite honestly, Dawn Jarrett came to me and said, you have to let me continue with my in January. These, ad these additional efforts have been very challenging for finance and human resources. And on behalf of the thousands of local people that will be served with these dollars, please join me in thanking We had a significant number of our own Carolina East family members affected, some devastated, by Florence. I was humbled time and time again to see the pledge cards come in to our office from the employees that I know from our hurricane assistance efforts were and still are struggling. 138 to be exact, 138 of your fellow staff members that are struggling to put their own lives back together chose to give to this year's campaign. We all can learn from their selfless heart. Hearts. So from the families that will be served through our patient assistance program, the 357 employee families that were assisted with the Employee Hurricane Assistance Fund, the local nonprofits that
news for you is no speeches for me today, just a couple of comments. Okay? Thank you for what you do every single day for our organization and those we serve. What, what, what you do every day makes a difference in people's lives. This is, this is just terrific and awesome and wonderful. It doesn't surprise me a bit because I know you and I know what kind of heart you have and I know what you do every day. Last year we took care of 401,000, I forgot how many, uh, patients. That's a lot of opportunities to demonstrate your servant's heart and to look for an opportunity to make a difference in somebody's life. This is one more example of the type of people that you are and, and what you do every single day and the difference that it makes. You can go home and lay your head on your pillow tonight and say, I make a difference. What I do makes a difference in this world. So thank you for that. Thank you to the foundation for their hard work, the team captains, everyone that was involved in this. I guarantee you the foundation will put this money to good use and every dime of it, including the 34 cent there at the end, will be used for that cause. None of that money will go to, to uh, take care of any overhead or anything like that. It'll all go just as you intended it to go, okay? Thank you for the culture that you've built here. Thank you for uh, protecting and defending that culture when it needs protecting and defending. Thank you for never lowering the bar for uh, demanding excellence and accepting nothing less than that. And thank you for your servant's heart. Thank you very much.